Hi everyone, and welcome back to Open Source Tonight. Let's get right on into it with today's video. So the NetBSD folks released this blog post on Xorg on NetBSD systems. Who would have thought they would talk about NetBSD? I thought this was interesting. I seen a thing about this. So here we go. They uh, talk about how if we want to really cut to the chase down here, talks a little bit about the history of Xorg and talks about NVIDIA cards and how all that's going to play into it. But if you look down here, the big question, does, it, does all of this have a future? The good news is that all new hardware has generic support in X. Someone writes either a mod setting kernel driver or a classic win or WS display. I wanted to say win display kernel driver, and they will be able to automatically they will be automatically supported by the associated drivers in X. So anyway, but they talk about this and how things are changing. Because in the Linux world, things are moving over here to Wayland, which you can see is slowly what looks to be happening on the BSD side too. Now, I'm not an expert when it comes to BSD, but I have played with FreeBSD in the past and... Uh, I actually never played with NetBSD, but I'm thinking I'm going to install it in a virtual machine here and play with it on the channel. So that's something to check out when I post that. But I think that at this point, when we talk about X on uh, BSD, I get the impression I get the impression it's less mature of an implementation at this point. The Wayland is. So we'll see how that all pans out. But I think I think that for different use cases, X may hold on for a good number of years still. I, I do think Wayland's interesting, and I have got it running on one machine, and that machine doesn't do anything fancy. So that's something to consider. Motif window manager and such like that. Will it work on non-X org? I mean, as far as I understand, no, because it's so dependent on the way X works. So could it be, you know, it's open source. Could it be modified to talk to Wayland, uh, Wayland Compositor? Or I guess it probably would just become a Wayland Compositor because it's a window manager. But either way, I suppose, but you're talking about a major project rewrite. So I think X org, X11, whatever you want to call it, I think it's going to be with us for a little bit longer. And so, you know, it's got a few flaws here and there, but it works. And at the end of the day, that's why I use Linux, is it works. <laughs> so anyway, everybody, let me know your thoughts about this in the comments. I just wanted to do a quick little video about it. I thought it would be a good idea. This is just something I seen when I was reading the news tonight, and I thought, well, it's time to hit the record button. So let me know your thoughts. Thanks for watching. See y'all again soon. Bye, everybody. And action.